It's Central Valley Business. I'm your host, Steve Walling. My guest for this segment is Central is Crystal Oliveria. I got that right? Yes, you did. Crystal, welcome to the show. And you're you're a coach, but you're a very special type of coach. Yes. Tell me about what you do. I'm a career coach and busy parents hire me to help their child select a relevant career. Okay. So you're a career coach for young people. Yes. All right. How did first off, how did you get into being a coach for young people? I mean that's that's gotta be a challenging uh, you know, profession to get into in the first place, but it's also got to be very rewarding and interesting. How how is it that you came to that? It's an extremely rewarding experience. Uh -huh. I get to watch kids' self esteem evolve and develop. Right. And so what happened was I used to focus on helping families afford college with scholarships, mm -hmm. and then parents told me I've been saving for college because I know it's important for my child. How do I make sure that the money I save for my child's college education is going to be well spent and my child selects a career that's going to utilize their talents and abilities? That's, yeah, okay, so we get a lot of kids without any guidance or anything and I'm going to go to college. Well, what are you going to do? I don't know. I'm going to go to college. Well, what college? You go? Well, you know, a good one maybe. Mm -hmm. But you catch them early. When do you start working with, with parents with their kids generally? I like to start as early as junior high and then I work with kids all the way through high school because what I found is parents are concerned about their child transitioning successfully from high school to college and from college into the workforce. You mean we just can't wait till that if we're going to graduate from high school day day and, and start our plans there, huh? Oh no. No? No. no it's important to plan early. Yeah, it puts a lot of anxiety on the kids to, for them to know what they need to be their junior year of high school. And they need to start planning. It's kind of like retirement. You don't start waiting till the year before you want to retire to start planning it. Oh well, I don't. Yeah. Okay. No, I get that. That's all right. That's important. So, um, how long have you been doing this? I've been doing it for six years. And off the top of your head, without you know, because a lot of this is private information, I understand. But give me the the most challenging. Uh, case that you worked with and give me the one that it may it might even be the same one the one that's been the most rewarding <laughs> okay the most challenging is working with a kid who comes in who's quiet and they're very shy and they absolutely don't want to talk about themselves because mm -hmm. they have low self-esteem okay the so, go ahead the most rewarding case is watching a child evolve and get over their fears of picking up a phone and calling to get an internship mm -hmm. that has led through a series of events where they ended up getting a paid internship to their dream. Um, well, Crystal, an internship, uh, now I, I would wager that probably 99%, maybe even 100% of most young people have no clue about this internship thing, but it's very important, isn't it? Oh, absolutely. You know, and and they're out there and they're available for young people that take the time to get involved, aren't they? Yes, and that's the exciting thing. These experts, they want to work with kids. They want to pass down their knowledge. Mm -hmm. And it's incredible because a lot of internships will pay for food, travel, expenses. They'll even include fun spending money. So if I dye my hair, shave my beard, I come to you, think we can work something <laughs> out, right? No, this is great. And But you work with these young people and you take them through this. Yes. And part of it is I always teach the skill sets that kids need to be successful in their career. What are the kind of skills that a, a young person might need? They need to be able to talk about themselves confidently and the value they provide, mm -hmm. regardless of whether it's a scholarship application, an internship application, a college application, or an application for a job position. And how important are college application forms, getting them filled out? Oh, it's very important because yeah. these colleges had tracked so many kids. You want to be sure your kid gets in because if they get all these rejection letters, that's going to ha that's going to affect their self esteem. It is, and and are there besides internships? Are there other outside of school activities that it's important for young people to be involved with when they're looking ahead to going to college? Oh, absolutely. Right. Everything from volunteering to getting involved and job shadowing. There's so many different ways kids can get exposure. Sounds like a lot of stuff. I can see why it would be very advantageous for someone to want to get a hold of a coach, a career coach like you. Mm -hmm. That's great. So how do we get a hold of a career coach like you? Well, I recommend that for parents to visit the website, mm -hmm. sevenwaystohelp.com. Sevenwaystohelp.com, okay. Yes. And what it is, is it's a 
complimentary gift of seven ways to have a relevant conversation with your child, mm -hmm. regardless of what age your child is, to help them figure out what's a relevant career for okay, them. Okay, Crystal, I'm going to stop you here for a second because you just you tickled something in the back of my <laughs> mind. Parents talking to their child. Mm -hmm. I'll bet you you do some coaching in that direction too, don't you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that can be very important, can it? And what, here's the thing that's so important, why I'm sharing this message, is because a lot of parents expect the high school guidance counselor to do all that work for them. Uh -huh. And on average, they might have 300 students, so their child isn't getting the individual help that they need and so deserve. So it becomes very important, doesn't it? Absolutely. All right, that's excellent. Now, you got a Facebook page or any other thing besides your web page to get a hold of you? Yes, I do. I'm on social media for Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn, and Google+. And we look for you by looking what? You can either look for me under my name, Crystal Oliveria. Okay. O-L-I-V-A-R-R-I-A. -R -R okay. Or as Career Conversationalist. All right, excellent. If you have a young person that is uh, maybe just getting to the end of their elementary school, now might be the time that you want to think about uh, looking down the line. And I'll bet you that helping a young person uh, figure out what it is that they, they they have areas of interest is something that you do also, isn't it? Yes, it's very rewarding. There you go. All right, very important. In today's world, there's a lot of competition for young people. Uh, everything you can do to help your son or daughter get ahead becomes critical. Crystal, thank you for being on the show, and thank you so much for what you're doing for our young people here in the Central Valley. That's great. Thank you. See you when we come back.